Um, yeah, and I think the, the viral uh, process is basically an energy process. When when the cells are well energized, they're resistant to uh, infection and replication of viruses. Right. And again, you're just saying that's from an energetic point of view to be able to withstand uh, the processes that cost e- energy to drive a system uh, more positively than uh, being overwhelmed, as it were. Yeah, and I, I think you can see the energy process in in the brain conditions that, that are associated with vitamin D deficiency. Um, uh, brain-injured patients uh, have very low vitamin D uh, and uh, probably the injury itself is uh, uh, causing it to be lost in some way. I, I, did, I read that Parkinson's was also, uh, they were also Im- Im- implicating low levels of vitamin D in, in some Parkinson's um, patients, showing that that was a uh, kind of interference, either a dop- dopaminergic type interference or uh, another neural signaling interference that vitamin D positively uh, influences. And the prion diseases are probably influenced because uh, vitamin D prevents the uh, polymerization of the prion protein, which is involved in uh, scrapie, mad cow disease, uh, Alzheimer's disease, and probably several other of the uh, degenerative brain diseases. Uh, Anxiety and and depression are uh, associated with very low vitamin D.